Hello everyone, my name is Web Weaver, and welcome back to another episode of It's Look Who It Is. We're once again here. I don't know what I did to the reshade, but it's kind of cooking black and white, but with the with the red accent. That's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. I don't know how I did it, though. I was just randomly messing with values. And uh, here we are. Now, I think I want to play a jury run. Uh, I'm feeling I'm feeling a jury run. And you know what? I'm feeling even more random because I can't decide. I just really don't want commoner, but I would be okay with ill-fated or medical history. I think both of those would be fine. I don't think we run. I don't think we run from these. Oh, backstory world of horror. Nothing. Okay. We take those. This looks sick as hell. This is Markiplier's iron lung. So true. <laughs> so true. You want to know how to scare today's generation? You weld them shut in a submarine and put them in an ocean, an ocean of blood. There's something down in that ocean and it's chasing them and they have to go to pre... the predetermined spots on the map. Well, they're welded shut in the submarine and not even the window works. Alright, we've got strength, we've got knowledge, we've got dexterity, maybe. Your seconds? I'll try to remember this time, I swear, I swear, I swear. Also, shoutouts to the fact that the B and A are white, and then the C is just just blood red. Oh my god, that kind of goes hard. Honestly, I think we I think we go for... We, we basically just want to get a weapon and then start balling, right? So, I don't really think it matters. Whether we have this or this, I think we'll be fine either way. Now, I am remembering the devious thing that you can do as Jerry, which is buy a carpenter's hammer. Because you you can take the carpenter's hammer and then pretty reliably use it. Because you're going to get so much EX... You're going to get so many levels so quickly. Minecraft brick, uh, dot PNG. Be upon ye. Um, I, you can basically, you level up so fast that the, that weapons that have horrible accuracy don't really matter, because they're gonna get to 100 pretty quick anyways. So, what we can do, what we can do, if I buckle down and lock in, I honestly think we might just take the flashlight here. I don't want to spend the doom necessary to do all that stuff. And you know what? I think we could open it with Bulletin. And by Bulletin, I mean Vigil. Because we're we're not gonna buy... We're, we're not gonna buy... Please don't be doomed. Please don't be doomed. That, that's a gamble you gotta take. That's a gamble you gotta take. Where... The meat cleaver is not good. But... It is a dangerous location, though. So our penalty is increased. We do want to skip the first fight, just because we... Actually, ideally, we want to skip both. So we, a we actually do want to skip both fights, because that's 6% uh, on the horror meter. Uh, is the small candle better than the meat cleaver? I think... We're probably okay with the meat cleaver for now... Just because I kind of value the damage. But no, 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 hold on. There there are some hosp hospital enemies. I mean, that's true. But uh, there are some hospital enemies that we certainly want to run away from. But there are some mansion enemies that we certainly want to run away from as well. So we've done the vigil. We've done the supper. Now we just need to get to 2 a.m. And I think we will, because we're playing as jury go ahead and even if it is the it is it the plant no it's burn the envelope we'll do that we'll do that that's fine because i think getting six percent on the horror meter yeah you're getting good exp but i think getting six percent on the horror meter is still like you know pretty bad um i think we just take the damage and then we move on we're gonna level up a lot so i i think we can kind of take like bad fights early I think that's one where you actually would benefit from the meat cleaver a little bit more, so burn the envelope. And we are not fighting the horrible old man. No way in hell are we doing that. That would be a horrible idea. But this is a dangerous location because we have the penalty, so we're not going to get any healing from the left option, so we might as well just... That's the coup it is. 
So we might as well just kind of, just kind of chill. Just kind of schmoove on through it. And then sacrifice guest, sacrifice guest, and we're done. An unseen force leads your hand. You reach for a knife. Well, listen, all I'm gonna say is that I willingly clicked the sacrifice the guest button. So maybe I am the unseen force. Who knows? Maybe that's what, uh... Oh my god, maybe I am the horror. No way. Elusive, quick thinking, art knowledge. I mean, elusive is pretty good, don't get me wrong, but I think we want the stats early. There was a knowledge check. Honestly, we can just keep using the, the small candle. I think that's fine. Did the bite become infected already? No, okay. So, yeah, we've got a knowledge and... Ah, crap. Our second enemy was the... Um, hold on. We haven't gotten to our second enemy yet because it was uh, animated head was our first fight. So whoever's next, and we need to remember our next mystery as well. So next fight, next mystery. Next fight, next mystery. Very easy to remember that. And what we can even do here is take this money that we forgot to grab originally, which was a mistake, but we now have enough to buy a magical item if we ever wanted to do that for some reason. And honestly, if we wanted to... Oh, it's roads closed. Okay, no, we can't... We, we can't actually justify this then, because I was going to say, if we wanted to maybe risk a doomed forest, we could go into Peculiar Painting right now, because we know the mansion's not doomed. Uh, but here's the problem with that. Roads closed, so we need to be a little bit careful with this. Although, I hate to, I hate to say it, we're gonna go Peculiar Painting anyways, <laughs> because we don't really have a good next mystery to do, because we're just kind of in hell. So, you know, it is what it is. It's look who it is, even. So we'll, we'll stay with you once. Now that's gonna hurt a little bit. That's gonna hurt a little bit. Now what we'll do is we will take the stamina that's fine. And then we're going to go back here. We're going to get a light source. We'll get plus one perception. It'll be great. We have a bite. That bite will get infected. Ah, eto bleh. And we'll be fine. We'll be locking it in. We'll be locking it in. I still think you don't... Like, even though you... Like, here's the thing. Originally, one of the gambits that you could do on jury was you could try to get a chainsaw and then just not care about how you have low stats for the rest of the run. Now that the horror meter actually gets lowered when you complete a mystery, I think it's entirely valid to say you actually... Okay, Rumu Ghost. And let me be real here. Oh, yeah. You know what? That's fair. That is not good. We are not having a good time right now. That's completely fair. So we could do six damage or six damage and something else. And by something else, I mean, uh, uh, um, uh, uh, I, I think we might throw the regular flashlight as well. And then what we do is we we still die, but hold on, hold on. How about three claps? How close does that get us? Ritual is too short to have any effect. You know what? Fair. How could I be so stupid? How how could I be so stupid? Oh, she just doubled her damage. That's that's right. Now, final log entries. Uh, your health. Uh, you try to sever their ties to this world. We we can't actually check if there was any like uh, log like message to say, hey, the enemy's about to kill you if you don't block. Fair enough. Uh, I I forgot that Rumu Ghost could do that. We run it back. We run it back. I don't think backstory is going to be so kind to us this time. 
I still kind of want to do a jury run. Uh, I still, I still feel like jury gaming. I'm still, I'm, I'm a little bit hurt though. I'm a little bit hurt. Nope, we, we, we're re-rolling that. I, I'm, I veto these. I 100% veto Eldritch Parasite runs. I apologize. But uh, I do not feel like, okay, you know what? Maybe jury's rancid. Maybe the game's trying to tell me that jury's a little bit rancid right now. So let's, um, let's switch gears a little bit. And let's go to... Hmm. I was thinking about what gear we're switching to, and honestly, I'm not entirely sure. Let's let, let's try a Yashiro run again. But we're we're gonna set up like a like a half decent run, okay? We're gonna we're gonna set up like a half decent run, something that you're not gonna be too worried about. Let, let, let's take the easy. Let, let's take some easy backstory, easy old god. And just sort of, like, relax ourselves into a Yashiro run. Am I going to remember our seconds this time? No. I already dedicated the brain power to remembering uh, Rumu Ghost and, and painting. So unless we just happen to get those things again, it ain't happening. So strength, knowledge, charisma, no dex. There is a light source. Was there a fight there? I probably should have been paying attention. Uh, there is not a fight. Okay, so we don't need a weapon going into the lighthouse. I don't see a seal of Slanesh there. Maybe I just completely missed it for no reason, but I didn't see it, so we take those. Alright, we're gonna go, we're gonna roll it like this, and I think we're gonna be okay. Bad start. We, we, we worry about that a little bit. It's the winter season, gotta wear a nice sweater. Uh, gotta wear a nice, uh, Faith-branded, uh, I-go-unwillingly sweater. We throw up one of these Minecraft brick.pngs again, and we run it back. We run it back. We see a little Moriko. And then we're on... We're, we're going. We're gaming. We're, we're, we're moving. Noisy nails, ward, botany, bullets, and eels. I mean, eels is a good place to start. It's a better place to start than anything else. Oh, yeah, we just can There's a new... There's an ending. It's not new, but, like, there's an ending where you just ditch the apartment. And then you'd never find out what happened to Kana. We're gonna have to... We're gonna have to get all the endings one day. That might be a... That might be a live stream. Just trying to get ending... <laughs> botany ending A again. The most, like... Um... I don't really want to lose my money, so we'll take an injury? That's a pretty bad one. You know, if we got an injury that I could ignore, then that would be, like, a pretty good play. But we actually didn't get an injury that I can ignore. We actually got an injury that I can't ignore. So we're sort of in this awkward situation now where I'm kind of just going for money. And then we almost just died. <laughs> I think this is a sign that World of Horror is going to be rancid tonight. As a treat, you know? And then what we're going to do is we're going to go to the hardware store. We're going to buy the first thing that I see. And then we are going to... I now don't have enough money to get my torn muscle cured. Or do I? No way. He's selling the doctor. The doctor's own drugs. He's a madman. He can't be stopped. And then we're going to spend a little bit more Doom just to... That was the school. That was the school that was doomed. All right, we're, we're moving now. We can now play the game. You may now play the video game. Well, that's just insulting, man. After what I went through, you're going to give me a ghost right off the bat. You're going to say, hey, you want to go fight a ghost, buddy? And it's like, I mean, I know we have the bronze crucifix, but I didn't have it equipped. I didn't have it equipped. You're going you're gonna to make me walk down that road right now? I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll throw hands, I'll throw hands, reluctantly, because th this, this shit's scary. Ghosts are scary as hell, man. Um, sure, I don't need money. Actually, no, I'd rather take two stamina instead of three. Ah, the seaside was safe. I should have gone there once earlier, just so that we could go there twice with Kana, because now that Kana's gone, now we're going to get into a fight at the seaside. Spooky. Okay, thank God. Uh, this is a skill check, but like, you know, I don't really think we have the skills for it, so we'll t we take those lucks. We we take luck, and then uh, we just die, I guess. We, we didn't do anything to have any positive impact on our faith. 
So we're just gonna eat it here. Nice. I, can we even justify saving Kana? Like, yes, obviously, but, like, what am I gonna do now? Oh, what was I- what was my spell? Void? Can I- can I void out of this situation? Okay, um... Oh, it's- wow, it's Blood Moon. That's fantastic. That's crazy, bro. Blood Moon moment? What- what- <laughs> Do we just sell the computer and build bulletin? No, 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 no. We run it back. We run it back. I don't. E I don't even know what to do. This is just a detritus night. This is just like it's all going wrong. We throw those on the downtown. We win these. I don't. Th I don't even think we win these. We're investigating the street. Do we not have anything better to do in our goddamn lives? Our faith hasn't moved. We haven't gotten a single plus faith thing. Oh boy. Okay, this is actually good. This is actually good. We, we can build up faith here in the smallest amounts, giving you power where it counts. I would actually much prefer if my faith were a larger number that was giving me power uh, expressly, uh, not in the smallest amounts, because this game quantifies faith as smaller amounts of faith actually give you less power. I know, right? That's uh, kind of counterintuitive to the song, but... It's just how the game works. Why Why am I not... Why Why am I not putting the police station on there? We're taking plus one stamina damage just for fun? We live those? Oh. And then, of course, we don't get to level up because sad, pain, peko, agony. We're just crawling through the goddamn glass at this point. Is this our second enemy? Is this really... Is, is this really the guy? We're, we're gonna take... Oh no, dude. Look at this. Look at that, man. Four, five, sure. This, this sucks, man. You missed your attack. Whoa. Listen, man, I need to hit one 55% chance. Thank you. And now our faith is, like, minus two'd. Oh. Uh, why, why, why does the faith start at five? What did Yashiro do to deserve this? What, what did Homeboy deserve? And what did I do to deserve these perks? Oh, my God. It was everything but dexterity, wasn't it? Oh, my God. Oh, gain 10 EXP from escaping from an enemy encounter. Brazy, dude. Whoa. I think we gotta take quick thinking just because, like, it's our highest stat, so we gotta leverage it. We gotta be like, okay, let's leverage the the goddamn... Okay, you're gonna hate me for this one. It's the it's the, the web, web, web... The web classic. Resting monument resting strat, where we're just gonna take stamina 80 million times. You know what? Sure, we take those. We we take those. We take those. That's fine. Let me sell the handcuffs. Let me sell the handcuffs. What have I done? Okay, 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 okay. Serve what? All right, sell the handcuffs. Sell the handcuffs. Don't be stupid. Don't be stupid. 5% doesn't do anything. 5% doesn't do anything. It doesn't do anything. We have freaking blood moon, man. Oh, okay. Do we just enter the portal? Do we just enter the portal? Enter the portal? Get plus one knowledge from a stat check? That'd be pretty nice. Oh. Yeah, sure. But, like, we have to spend Doom to get this cured, right? So it's, like, it's not even that good. What, what does this do? I don't know. We succeeded it. Sure. I mean, we have to spend Doom to get it cured regardless because you get Frostbite on all of them, so it doesn't really matter. Ominous letter moment. Oh yeah, bro. Let me let me spend mine. <laughs> Come on, man. Why? What is this? You kill one and a half enemies for minus five reason. Oh. Press this button to instantly die. Yeah, I I, I know your millennial humor. You'd slam that button as a joke. Oh. 
Well, if we ever need to, uh, if we're ever gonna die to Doom, I can just press that button, and it would be really funny. It, it's plus three, too. That's so sad. Like, I actually am gonna say this. It's not from the perspective of how the game does, like, faith calculations. It's not actually that unreasonable. Because, like, you take, um... Because you'd have to kill two enemies to get four faith. Or kill an enemy and complete a mystery to get that amount of faith, right? And that's like, you're going to take a lot of damage in the process of doing that in order to get that faith. So maybe it's worth it. Maybe it's worth it. I got to take sanity here, right? Like, I just got to. Like, I, I think I just have to take sanity here. We're going to really need... We're really, we're really going to need on our own at some point. Like, that's just kind of a necessity. We're going to have to get rid of Kana. At some point... Oh, whoa, crazy. I mean, sure, we run it back. Because we, we don't have roads closed yet, so... Wow, I really am stupid as hell. I, I really did just move the police station twice unnecessarily. That's great. Okay. So... Oh, God. I remember my second enemy, right? Like, I said that out loud. It'll just come back to me later. Yeah, 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 yeah. It, it'll, it'll come back to me later. I got this. I got this. I got this. Just give me the doom. Just get... Roll a one! <laughs> Roll a one. Give me money. Okay. We take those. Uh, by the way, here's your, uh, I don't know, your, your daily call to action TM. Um, so, the... Whatchamacallit's... But we should do, like, a strategy meeting video to, like, really hammer it home or whatever. Hammer it home? I don't know why I said it like that. We miss those. True. So true, bestie. I, I mean, as long as we, like, kill her next turn, which we will, then we're gonna get back to 10 faith, but... I don't, I, I'm, not, I'm not doing the side quest. I'm not, do, I'm not doing the side quest. I'm not doing the, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. Uh, but, like, okay, so, we've gone through the monetization ways a few times, and people have been really good at watching the ads and doing the memberships. We got more members in, like, the first two months than I thought, like, I mean, I'm not even gonna say how many members I thought we were gonna get and how quickly, uh, because... I, I had I actually had no frame of reference. I just put it up there. I had no idea what was gonna happen. But um basically the one of the best things that you can do to help the channel, and it's entirely free, is to leave a like or a dislike, but I am I am a I'm fragile, so I prefer likes, but both help. Both genuinely help. Uh, if you ever wanted to punish a content creator, nothing is the best weapon. Because if you dislike a video and comment, you're giving them, like, you're basically one of their most valuable viewers. Right? Because YouTube does distinguish, I, I don't know if they just, I don't know how much they dis distinguish between likes and dislikes. But they view dislikes as a good thing. Like, dislikes are an objective, positive thing for the YouTuber. So, that's uh, just, a, I, I like, a fun fact, I guess? I, I don't really know if that's actually a fact that's fun or not. This is so greedy. This is so greedy. Because what we're trying to do here is preserve our health and our... Oh, that was so greedy. I mean, it's still greedy because we could miss that, but we didn't. Um... So if, if so, the best way to uh, like if you ever wanted to like like a YouTuber did something you really didn't like and you were like you know I don't like this YouTuber anymore disliking the video bad idea on your part because it's an objective benefit um, I because I, I I don't really know why YouTube does it the way that they do it but likes and dislikes both help a lot I would prefer likes though because even though I'm the only one who can see them without a uh, add-on it's still like i don't know i don't like dislikes i don't like thumbs down i like to see thumbs up but uh doesn't matter as long as you click one of them it's fine <laughs> both help a lot and then um 
I think we just get a grip here. That's fine. Uh, but the very important thing that you can do is comment. You could do a algorithm comment moment. Uh, Sage has been doing a lot of algorithm comments, and they're great. And we need... Well, we don't need, but, like, if you wanted to help the channel, algorithm comment is the way to go. And also, like... It's a little bit weird, right? Because the metric that we've always done really, really well over, like, every other YouTube channel around my size, and even some of the bigger YouTube channels, is watch time. Like, I have always had a really, really impressive watch time stat. Like, I had over the watch time requirements for, a, for YouTube, like, whatever, for, like a year and a half like i think like we've been doing this for three years right i think i had like well over the watch hours for a uh, youtube monetization for like a year and a half we we've always had incredibly good watch hours and uh viewer retention and watch time so i don't really need to worry about that like the average viewer duration for these videos is like half the length of a video which for something that's unedited and it's just me talking to the camera and doing a, a couple runs of world of horror that's really good like that's really good so i we're, we're knocking it out of the park in that regard i think we do we take doom here no we take the stamina begrudgingly because the only other, like, stamina thing I can really think of is, like, the, whatchamacallit, the mountain that you can climb. And I don't mean, like, the safe route, quick route. I mean the guaranteed strength check for minus two stamina or whatever. One doom. Yeah, we're kind of in the point right now where... I don't even know why I did it like that, because I can guarantee one of the attacks. We're kind of at the point right now where we're not really worried about as much as we might otherwise would be. We're going up to 70. Uh, 70 Doom, two mysteries left. It's certainly doable. I'm still a little bit concerned. I think we're probably going to get memed on second mystery, second enemy, because I definitely only remember Rumu Ghost and Painting, which is not, not a run that went anywhere. So we're kind of in a weird spot. I, you would do this to me on the day of my empty bottle? What the hell? Should have drank that wine earlier. Wordless Ward is a really bad one, too. Wordless Ward is a really bad one as well. Like, I'm not happy with that. Like, I think this means that we lose, because this is 5% Doom, or it's a really strong boss fight that does stamina damage. So it's like... Noisy Nails, I think, is the least of our problems, because we have... <laughs> we have Doom coming up. I think we do Wordless Ward. Maybe we should have done Noisy... No, I want to level up one more time before we do Noisy Nails. And that is a loss. A branded like cattle like that, nah, nah, nah. It's over. It's it's Jover. You you can't you you can't get something like that and win. They're they're gonna we're gonna let her sleep just to reduce the threat level. And I mean that's just, it's still like you you're not uh, you're not seeing the end of the game with that one, Chief. That one's real bad. The hospital is a very dangerous location, too, so the idea that you get to preserve your health before you get to the boss is, like, uh, not really. Stay strong is so good. Stay strong is so good. That is, like, the most important Yashiro thing you could possibly get. How do you beat this? Like, this is a tough fight on a normal, like, on a, on a really good character. How do you beat this on a character who's, like, dog, like, dog water, you know? Like, how, how, how do you look at this and go, like, it's look who it is, and be like, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, we're, we're still not at the, at any point. Like, we would have to land both of these, so that's a 74%. 64%?! Oh my god, we landed it. We did land it. But, like, oh my god. 
that's a tough ask. On your own is really good. We need that. And I think we need to take stamina here because we're going to fight a stamina boss and we won't be able to run away. Or do we take strength? Strength's really good. Getting to... Because that would take us to seven strength with the monkey wrench. That's really... That's good. Those are decent stats, but we just need the stamina. Because if we take one point of stamina damage before we get to the boss, like, it's over, right? So... I mean, we, we just have to go. It's dangerous here. Penalty increased, by the way. Like, wh like what do you want me to do? Um... Uh, charisma or perception. I don't actually remember which one does stamina and which one does reason, but the thing is, if we lose either, we basically lose the game, right? So, I am gonna do a Wa wiki to figure out which one's stamina, because that's the one that we should do. But, and I should know this by now. I've seen this event, like, literally, probably, like, 500 plus times. Not even a joke. Search the cabinet. That's the one. We do a little searching the cabinet. And I mean, it's like... I mean... It's not... Unwinnable. But the chances that we win are extremely low. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh no, dude. Oh no. Like, it's not impossible. It's actually not impossible. Uh, let's, let's just guarantee it. I don't know why I'm trying to get fancy about it. We're gonna see mystery whatever, but it's not looking too good. And we somehow are still at 21 faith, and our bathtub is still not working, which is great. I'm, I'm a big fan of that. Now it's look who it is. Noisy Nails is a longer mystery, too, as well. That's one of the things that makes it pretty dangerous, is, like, it's a long mystery, and you're fighting a really hard boss. Now, I don't really know what to, I don't really know what to tell you here. It's not looking too good, Chief. Uh, okay, so this is gonna do, I mean, 80, 80, we can do an 80, 90, sure, why not, oh, crazy, alright, that's gonna be the episode for now, what we're gonna, what we're gonna end up doing is, it's look who it is, and listen, we're on a little bit of a losing streak, that's fine, the game got a lot harder, we've known this since we started playing 1.0, um, sorry, I'm a little, I'm a little eepy, I'm a little eepy right now, I will admit, uh, but there are going to be a lot more videos coming out on the channel, and we're going to have, we're gonna have significantly more videos on the channel. I don't know if we're gonna be able to get to 14 videos a week. But it is seeming increasingly more and more likely that we'll be able to do content more and more frequently. We did the first episode of Gloomwood. We did a Lethal Company. Lethal Company's beta branch has a weekly challenge moon that is like you get purple like jumpsuits and you go into this preset seed to try to get a certain amount of loot. We're doing that with Kiwi. And we got Mystery of the Druids. The finale came out recently. And Lunacid is on break, because I just realized this is the Thursday episode. Lunacid is on break for one week because Josephine edits on the weekends. And the weekend that she would have ep edited this episode would have been Christmas Eve weekend or <laughs> Christmas Eve, because she usually does it on Sunday. So I wasn't obviously going to... It would be incredibly dumb of me to even imply that she should edit on Christmas Eve because that's, you know, incredibly stupid and mean of me. So, you know, obviously she didn't edit on Christmas Eve 
because she normally she ad, she edits over the weekend and it's normally Sunday. So Lunacid is getting pushed back by a week, but other than that, we should be getting there's going to be a video on Saturday and Sunday. And next month, I'm looking to have a video come out on Friday as well. We'll see. I'm I'm looking, I'm thinking it should happen. No promises yet about Friday videos, but we have RimWorld on Saturdays and Bonus on Sundays, which uh, you will see soon, TM. Thank you so much for watching. My name has been Webweaver. Have a good one. Stay safe out there. I'll see you on the next episode of World of Horror or whatever you decide to watch next, which I am going to make a legitimate thing. You got Lunacid, you got Lethal, you got Gloomwood. You're going to get RimWorld on the weekend. We're, we're going to have... This is the age of variety content, okay? This is the age of variety content. That is what I want for... <laughs> all I want for Christmas is to make variety content. Uh, because I, I just... I More videos. That's, that's what I'm trying to do. And we're going to see how that works out. I'm going to try to have it going for like a month or two. We'll see what happens. Stay safe out there. Have a good one. And, uh... There are other things to watch, and there are more World of Horrors as well. World of Horror will be daily. Everything else is going to be on a weekly schedule. Thanks.